Our friends over at Halo Black have sent us a couple of new products here. We've actually had quite a few different accessories from the same company for the Tesla over the last six months. We've done something a bit different. So normally what we do, we'd unbox these, put them in the car, kind of learn about them together. But I was really skeptical about both of these products. I saw them on the Halo Black website and I actually reached out to them and said, hey, love the accessories that we've had to date. How about you send us these? We'll check them out and have a look at them. So big thanks to Halo Black for sending these our way. But had these in the car for about a week now because I wanted to test them out, in particular, the floor mats to see if they were really better than the OEM Tesla mats. And what I can tell you is that I absolutely believe these are worth every dollar that Halo Black are charging for them. This here is seat storage organization. So in the Tesla, under the seats, you do have a lot of room there, but you can't really put anything under there because it slides around. So this solves that problem, essentially slide out trays. So what we'll do, instead of unboxing these, like what we typically do, we'll just go inside the car and I'll show you why I think you want to have these and this in your Tesla. So Halo Black make these mats with four different options. So you've got left-hand drive, right-hand drive we obviously have the right-hand drive variant here and then they make two different options one with the nylon carpet and then one without the carpet so we went right-hand drive with the nylon carpet here and i think you should be able to see just from the shot here the fitment of these this is something that i was skeptical about because on the website it shows them as a really tight fit essentially you've got your two-piece design so you've got your it's almost like a plastic composite mat there's five layers to this whole product. And what it does is it almost sits in there tight, like a tub, comes up right against the edge. And what it means then is that when you're cleaning your car, generally what you do is you pull your floor mat out, you'd vacuum underneath, then you would vacuum your carpet mat here. This here aims to catch all dirt, debris, it's really wrapped nicely here within this actual plastic mat. And then you've got your removable piece here as well so I'm going to take this out and show you what this looks like pop it back in and then we'll show you around the rest of the car just how nicely these fit so it's a really nice snug fit here so obviously to take it out you do need to kind of peel it up a bit because they've really got their tolerances quite tight which is what you want for a matte design like this then we can take it out and what you can see there is it's it's not hard molded but I mean there's some rigidity to it which is nice because it keeps its shape well to the interior design of the car. So what you've got here is, this is almost like a, uh, it's almost like a marine nylon on the really, I guess that's the hard wearing area. That's where you've generally got the heels of your feet while you're using the pedals. And then under here, so you've got these little tabs, really nice the way that these come out. And then, so you've got like a non-slip material here, same on the bottom you've got these um these little dot or these little ribs so it sits very snug and it doesn't slide around once it's in the car i feel like that the fact that this is removable and it's not attached to here is really nice because what you've got here is something that you can hose off as well so if you spill some liquid on here unlike your typical floor mats where it could seep through and actually get into the carpet on the surface of the car this is going to contain it all on here then obviously you can pull this piece out here as well, snaps in place really nicely. So my concern of this and the reason why I wanted to try it out for a little bit before making a video, I just wasn't sure if this would slide around and cause any issues, but it locks in there really tightly and you do have to use a bit of force to unclick it. So that there, I think it's pretty fantastic. And just like the uninstall, installing it here, you just need to ride around and I mean they've got the fitment fantastic on this I'm really really impressed with just how tight it fits I mean you haven't got much of a tolerance on these here but it sits in there it doesn't slide around at all and then I mean you've got your pull tabs here so you could just peel that out when you need to clean that that's the front driver side so same guys with the passenger side here again fitment is fantastic just the way it wraps around here you've got no gap that's the area there that you typically get a lot of dirt and it just molds really nicely tucks its way under the seat there as well and again you've got the ability to just go and pull the mat out using those uh those clips 
I like the little touch on here as well, the little halo black logo. Kind of looks a little bit gimmicky online, but when you actually get these and you see the fit and finish of them, these are well worth the money that Halo Black are charging for them. They really are a premium finish. I think the area that I was most excited about these is the back seat where my daughter sits because obviously with a child, this is the area that gets the dirtiest. And if you have a look in there and just have a look at the fitment, the way it goes under the, uh, the middle console there, really, really covers the majority of the back seat there and again has that kind of wing design where it runs up along the door sills to try and contain all of that dirt so just the fit and finish of these I think is pretty fantastic I would highly recommend anyone who has a Tesla they sell these for the Model Y and the Model 3 to pick these up the back mat is a large piece so I don't know if you call that a downside but that comes out as a whole piece and you've got two clips on that one there versus the two on the other one. But I mean, if you have a look at that with the mat out, that's essentially the way that you would buy the other option from Halo Black if you didn't go with the carpet on it. I think you definitely want the carpet. Just has a nice premium finish. All right, and then we've got the seat storage organizers here. So these come as a set of two. They're 79 US dollars. Essentially what it is, is it's a plastic tub. But like anything Halo Black, the fitment of this is really precise. So you've got like a non-slip mat in here as well. So you could take this out. You're gonna find that things will slide around in here, but it means that this can easily be cleaned. When you put this in here, obviously fitment, really nice and you've got that non-slip element to it so yeah i mean if you put a drink bottle in there it's going to roll around but if you put something in there that has a bit more volume to it it should sit quite nicely i mean essentially the way that these work so you've got two one for the passenger seat one for the driver's seat got your nice handle on there these just slip like that under the seat if you want to pull it out you can pull it halfway you can pull it out all the way easy to take out so they just sit there. One thing I have noticed with these is the fitment's quite nice here because it does stop it from going too far under the seat. The way that that's designed though, you do on occasion feel this on the back of your leg as you're driving the car. So I think that that's something, especially if your seat is further back, like if I'm driving and my seating position's further forward, like my wife, she wouldn't feel that at all. But if you're a bit taller, and your seating position's a bit further back in the car, just something to be aware of that could potentially hit the back of your ankle. But I think for the extra storage that you get, having that under there, it's, um, it's not something you're short of in this car at all. You've got plenty of storage. You've got your front, you've got your boot, big center console, you've got the middle or the front center console. But I think that's just quite nice to have something that is stowed away out of sight as well. So, you know, you could put an iPad or a laptop in there and um, you could actually probably put food in there as well. You know, if you're going on a road trip and you do want to have snacks, you pop them in there because if anything leaks, you can simply take that out and you can walk. Is it annoying to access while you're driving? Like if you were sitting in the car? Oh, look, if you've got this in here, um, common use case for this in this car will be my wife's makeup. Yeah. So, I mean, you can get it out while you're driving. Not too much issue at all. And I mean, really, because it's quite wide, you're just dropping it in there and you're sliding it closed. So really, the only thing to be wary of is if you are sitting quite far back and you have your feet here, I don't know how often you're going to have your feet all the way back here. Generally, when you're driving, you've got one foot here and then one on the uh, on the pedals. But I mean, I think that there was sceptical. It's really tight, though. So it's easy to slide out, but it doesn't rattle around at all. Like if I get my hand and I'm going side to side on that quite forcefully, you've got no rattle, no noise at all while you're driving. So I think that's an accessory that you want. Previous video, we talked about this. This is the Halo Black cup holder. I think you want this as well. And to be honest, we'll go all in Halo Black here. You want this too. This little insert tray, which we're using for, you know, garage door remote. We got some coins in there, ear pods. I've taken this out many times, just like the cup holder and cleaned it because with this, um, it's like a medical grade silicon and it's really easy to clean. You've got your lower bit there that you could hide something if you wanted to. But Halo Black have done a fantastic job on these accessories. Pretty well priced for some of these organization ones. The mats are on the pricier side. 
Um, but I think that if you've invested in a Tesla and you want a premium experience, Halo Black, to me, is a premium accessory line. So huge thanks again to Halo Black for sending these products our way. They seem to continue to innovate. There's a lot of companies out there making accessories for Teslas and they seem to copy each other. You know, you've got all of these different things that you can buy through 100 different companies. Halo Black are the only one to me that really seem to have innovated and come up with some new designs. I mean, these mats are a perfect example of it. If there are any other accessories out there that you guys think that we should check out, if you think anyone else is innovating rather than copying, We'd love to. Uh, we'd love you to link them down below. We'll um, we'll purchase them, check them out, and review them and compare them against these. But otherwise, I think you want these. I think you need to get on Halo Black's website, order these. You won't be disappointed.